all right everybody welcome back to another video um like i said we're not guessing the episode but we have taken some time off i was away with my family on a little vacation so uh we took about 10 days off we did some trading we had some cards that ended up selling for us we bought danny almo um i think around like 230 240 way before the final he sold uh we bought muller for a weekend league we sold him uh lost tax uh caddy glue we i think packed him in a 93 plus uh, or 94 plus whatever the uh uh make your mark team uh pick was i can't really remember and then that tradable team of the season pick uh we got anton sold him and then some of the bronzes i've just been selling for 150 coins just trying to get them up we have a ton of guys here um i'm just gonna relist all of them hopefully they sell for 150 coins a lot of guys uh you know like jed brown is you know max price so we'll see if guys sell it's for the evo which we will talk about um before we get into our champs games we do have a champs weekend league um the club looks a little different this is going to be our team for champs obviously the bench i need to fill out uh three more spots but tons of new cards i'm not even going to like go into everybody we finished the cup so we have uh james we have uh kiesa and bony faces on the bench because we have done sorloff uh i'm not a big you know aerial plus merchant um my biggest reason for doing him is after watching nick's video i want my striker tiki taka plus just being able to move the ball fast especially a big hold up striker it sucks that he doesn't have press proven i think press proven on a big man and tiki taka plus would be the most broken thing um we are going to put an engine on him we also have reeton we have mertens and we have fabinho in the squad to do alex scott and then i want to try out sosa reason being is I like my other wing back to be very tall and his stats are relatively good with a shadow to be a defensive fullback as Reese James is going to push forward. That's why he has the guardian on for the agility. So this can be the team. Uh, we're just going to go basic on everybody. Weekend league is, you know, it is what it is. We're going for 11 wins and you will see uh, some highlights of this team. Hopefully we can cook something up and then the rewards after. So yeah, let's get into it. Alrighty, game number one against Galaticos. Uh, ooh, what a team. What a team. All right, let's see how sweaty this is. Nice, good play. Guy's very, very jammed up in the middle there, so. Nice. Oh, beautiful goal. Let's go. She is so good. Oh my gosh, this team is playing amazing. Nice. Beautiful goal. Okay, dude. Wee. Alrighty, we'll get into the next one. That was a good win. Nice. So, so, so good. Easy. What a play. What a play. That card is so unfair. Oh my gosh, we're flying. All right, good second win. All right, let's get to the last game. Let's go. It's the only way. Delict is going to have like 10 goals by the end of this uh, champs run. This game is so bad. What a pass though. I love that like directional passing. And the ball was so 
Cassier, bang! Let's go. First two games, <clears throat> three wins. Team feels good. I need to try and uh, fix in those, uh, not fix in, but put in those Evos. Um, gameplay wasn't super long, so I'm just gonna talk quickly. We have, um, I think, what is it? The number nine Evo for Hanson. So you will get the three playstyle pluses. I bought her, Puteles, and um, Mbappe. Um, Mbappe for like 1.5 or like 150, sorry. I bought her obviously for 24 and then Putellas was like 21 maybe, just in the event they get Evos, right? If I can get an Mbappe Evo, that'd be crazy, even a little bit down the line. Um, so Hanson's gonna be really good. Her balance is gonna be 80. So it's just another fun card. She's got a ton of aura, a bunch of jam. So it is what it is. Uh, she'll get press proven and I think <clears throat> power shot maybe. Um, and then for the new bronze Evo, we have this Nastic card, obviously no play styles, but I will show you him when he is completed, if we can get him done. Full 90 besides shooting. And as that left back role, I'm gonna try him out Sosa I love right now, but he could be insane because he's going to get um, Incisive Pass Plus, Long Ball Pass Plus, Anticipate Plus, and what's the last one? Maybe it's not Aerial. I can't remember what the last one is, but his playstyles will be very, very good. Um, this Sosa card, amazing. I'm going to keep him just in case we get an Evo for him, but that's going to be the gameplay. Get into the packs uh, when we finish. And hopefully uh, 11 wins comes pretty easily. And yeah, see you guys then. Alrighty. We have done it. We went 11 and four, 11 and four, I believe. Team felt good. Um, definitely use some different players. We'll look at that after we get through these picks. Uh, do deck for some fodder straight into the exchange. Um, oh, very nice. I definitely want to talk about an SBC that I completed that I was not very impressed with. Oh my gosh. That's insane. Lo Celso. Damn. That's crazy. What a card. All right. Let's follow it up. Hmm. Uh. That's, does he not have? Yeah, I know he does. And then Jack. Uh. Probably gonna be Marquinhos. All right, let's get into the packs. Um, yeah, so I guess before we get into the packs, cause I'm definitely gonna end the video after those. I am going to show you guys what I was talking about first with the evolution. So Nastic's evolution, we have two more, uh, two more levels. This is his final evil. Obviously it says center back, but alternate position is left back. Look at this card. Besides dribbling, which I don't do a heck of a lot of dribbling with my left back, just because I uh, primarily use them, use him now as a defend, like a defensive left, like not a wing back. Um, I think this card's really cool. I just wanted to do the Evo just because. Uh, I think he's gonna have a guardian on him just to boost the defending and his dribbling, and like pretty bad play style but he's got really good passing play style so i can get out of some tight situations um obviously we're evoing neymar a couple other things i might put i don't really tau into the fuddy's evo 2 just to see what he's gonna look like obviously as a 91 he will go to a 93 i believe he'll have aerial plus it'll be pretty cool the team obviously i just give my games away with this not using a bronze team um this is what we finished with. Luchimi, unbelievable. Sosa, great. We took um, Courtois out and put Schmeichel in. I just thought he was a little bit better, honestly. Um, Reese James is good. I don't think I would keep him, though. Uh, I think I like Navas a little bit more, just with the five-star skills. Brought back Valverde. This card is so amazing defensively. Like he just tracks back like a demon. Obviously, pink pass plus is amazing when I get the ball running up the right side now, which is the uh, wing back side I attack from after I change my tactics. Card's great. Sorloff is 
unbelievable like tiki taka plus is nice obviously it would be good if i had another player uh with tiki taka plus but because we put an artist on him he gains like he has 95 agility it's insane um and then delpy and puskas came in <clears throat> charlton's kind of a weird one he played good but his his pat like he doesn't have good passing play styles like this card is formatted so weirdly in the play style department but like his card is phenomenal it's really really weird i don't know i might put a hawk on him and just boost his uh boost his physical up as well as his pace max it out and we'll see but i don't think he's better than uh chappy who i've been using kind of in that role so let's get into these packs i don't know if we really get anything great pack wise um obviously this is the first weekend league i've played when the pack switches like changed over so we get an 83 85 by 3 rare players in ultimate so nothing crazy <clears throat> excuse me a horrible cough it's gonna be an icon it's good too so could be a good start if we're looking at a double here we are not so let's see what's behind Gattuso. i definitely felt uh this weekend was extremely like ai based i played a lot of like really mid players that kind of got bailed out a lot just by defending with their dms that's nothing new obviously but at the same time it's just it's kind of boring you know what i mean um it's not even gonna be right and that's crazy 84 out of an ultimate pack actually the worst pack in the game like you can't you can't change my mind i'll take the coins I'm not gonna use those guys um i don't know if we have any sbcs that we're looking at doing but we might do some 82 player picks get some fodder up um the uh, the player i wanted to talk about i don't even know why i didn't was modric every time i play modric in that right for or right or left mid position where he's a holding midfielder kind of box to box it messes with my dm like everybody plays very close together i played a guy that just had acres of space and just pick picked me apart and i like tried moving him over tried switching him with cruz it just wasn't working so i think i'm gonna play him maybe as an attacker uh like at that lcm spot but regardless that's for another video we're gonna end on this 83 by 5 good start get to see some specials german right wing Ugh. oh sane decent double i guess into bon pastor so we will see who's hiding it's probably not gonna be anything great it's just a trent alexander arnold uh if you enjoyed the video remember to like comment and subscribe uh i think the gameplay was pretty quick but we played some really good FIFA right at the start, went eight and two to start, and then kind of drifted off at the end, which sucks. But yeah, having fun playing FIFA again, took a nice break. So I'm going to be back with a lot more content. Um, I do promise short form content is coming. So for people who like watching shorts, you'll see it very soon. Um, but I hope you have a good rest of your day and press the out. Peace.